welcome to the show. Just doing some star spotting, but not the sort of stars you'd see at a Hollywood blockbuster. The stars you see every night when you look up into the heavens. Now, I'm going to need something a little bit bigger than that. I found the right place. I'm at the Grove Creek Observatory just south of Bathurst. Anybody can come here. So while I'm waiting for night time to come, get ready to be dazzled. Because here's what's coming up on the rest of the show. Well, I told you I needed a bigger telescope, and here it is, the C-14 here at Grove Creek Observatory. And you know the great thing about this place compared to a lot of other observatories? You can actually come up here and look through this telescope. And believe it or not, they even trust me. The observatory is run totally by volunteers, and the head stargazer is Steve Williams. If you go to some other public observatory, usually you'll see the telescopes, but you'll see them through a, a piece of three-inch piece glass because they won't let you near them. Yeah. Here at Grove Creek, you're actually allowed to look through the telescopes. You're allowed to take pictures. I mean, that's the ultimate holiday shot. Um, it it's all is the ultimate on. holiday shot. Well, aren't I looking forward to that? To infinity and beyond. No city lights, no pollution, and the buffer of the Great Dividing Range gives Grove Creek the best dark skies around. Perfect for staring into space. You can jump on the telescope and scan the heavens and check out anything you want. But if there's something special you want to find, and for me, it's Jupiter, you can come down in the control room, find it on the computer, and because Steve and I have organised the telescope, you just got to click on there. Connection established. Well, I hope so. Let's go and check it out. Well, let's see. Oh, well, there it is. Jupiter. And you know what? I can even see the stripes on the planet. <sighs> Amazing. The centre of our galaxy passes right over the top of Grove Creek giving me the best seat in the house. These shots were all taken from here, and I gotta say, I'm starstruck. Wow. When you look through the telescope, all that's out of this world seems 900 times bigger. Now, if you can get out here at the end of August, you'll see Mars like no one's ever seen it before. Cause it's the closest it's been to Earth in 60,000 years. Yeah, well, if you think of this, Light travels at 300,000 kilometres per second. Now, I've shown you galaxies here tonight that the light left there millions and millions of years ago when dinosaurs were roaming on the Earth. So if you think of the telescope as a time machine, every time you're looking through the telescope, you're looking back in time. And I thought I was struggling to get my head around it before. Grove Creek Observatory is just south of Bathurst, about four and a half hours drive west of Sydney. Tours are $240 per person, which includes two nights accommodation. To book, call 9438-1516 or go to their website, gco.org.au. When you come out to Grove Creek, bring your camera. And if you've got an old SLR like me, Steve tells me these are the best cameras to do astrophotography. Now, all you've got to do is take your lens off, and Steve's got plenty of adapters here that you screw straight on to the back of the telescope. We're trying to take a photo of the Orion Nebula. Wind him on. Now, I've got to expose him for 30 minutes. So while I'm going to twiddle my thumbs and wait for this photo, there's plenty happening out and around this weekend. It's back. I just can't seem to drag myself away from this telescope here at Grove Creek Observatory and you're not going to believe what I've just discovered in the heavens. Orion's belt and sword, known to the layman, and you'll know this one, as the saucepan. And I'm zoomed right the saucepan. Just in time, there is a kitchen here where you can cook up your own tucker. And I've just whipped up something very quickly for dinner. Well, you guys hungry? You guys hungry? <laughs> After the break, you'll be eating out as well. Not bad, either. When you come out here to Grove Creek Observatory, take the time to just step outside and look up. It is unbelievable. 
and it is so dark out here, you're seeing me like this because we're using a special night vision camera. And hey, check that out over my left shoulder. That's it, you got it. It's the Southern Cross. Man, I'm telling you now, nature is putting on an unbelievable show for us. But we've got two shows for you next week. Our normal show, which is on Saturday at 5.30, and a Great Eat special, which is on Sunday at 5.30. Don't miss it. Here's a quick taste. Another cracker coming up next week. Hope you've enjoyed the show, and I'll see you next weekend.